All right, so today we're gonna harvest this tiny little Armando. It's really funny because Scott and I got like the same size cutting and mine has done nothing but grow roots and he's got two, three dude, new shoots. This thing's beast mode, dude. <laughs> and he's got this fruit. It's been on here for about uh, 35, 40 days, right? I can't believe it made it. I know, it's crazy. It's small, it must be like a quarter pound. But we're gonna taste it and just see what happens. Yeah, see what happens, yeah. It's been red for probably like seven to eight days, I'd say. And if you watched our video on Exotica Nursery, this is where we bought some rare cuttings of dragon fruit and we got this cutting from there. So Scott and I each got one, he got fruit, I have nothing. So I'm gonna go <laughs> ahead and cut it and uh, show you kind of how we wanna cut it. And I learned from Linda Nickerson, you wanna stick it in and cut it like that and save a little bit of the flesh of the dragon fruit. So you can see even, if you come around here, Scott, come over here, did you notice that this <coughs> same branch produced a fruit probably last year? You right. can see they removed it. That's how they do So it. here we go, this tiny little petite dragon fruit. It's beautiful, Armando. Yeah. I've had Armando before, I don't remember it being really sweet. Yeah, it's more berry-ish and, and great for juicing, but it'll be fun to taste test probably the world's, one of the world's smallest dragon fruit right. from the smallest dragon fruit cutting. I mean, this thing is what, 18 inches maybe? It's on pretty, a good day? <laughs> it's, yeah, it's pretty small. It's, so, it's definitely girthy though. <laughs> yeah, Armando does have a really thick kind of girth um, and it's more like a cactus variety of dragon fruit, I would say. It's much more cactus-like and very thick um, compared to other varieties like a Guatemalensis. So we're gonna cut this open and taste it, give it a wash, and uh, we'll see what it tastes like in a second. All right, so here's this tiny little Armando. And you can see, it's ripe, beautiful reddish, kind of purplish flesh. It's a good color. And it definitely is small, but to me, it looks ready to eat. So let's try some. One of the world's smallest fruit. Unreal. All right, there we go. It's actually kind of bland. Is it? Yeah, it tastes like a, needs more flavor. Maybe it just didn't have enough size to produce enough sugar. Nah, yeah, it's very low sugar, so I bet I, it will sweeten up in time, but I hope all our Armandos do not taste yeah. like this, to be honest <laughs> with that, you. It's that uh, sweet, Dude, huh? you try it. Take I'll a bite. Try it. All right, let's try this. Yeah, I think um, maybe because of the size of the plant, it couldn't generate enough sugar. Yeah, that's we what do, I would guess. Or maybe we need to leave it a little longer. I don't know. Yeah, but it's getting cold this time of year, so yeah. it's a very late season. All right. Take a bite. Yeah. It's just flavorless. I mean, it's it's got the dragon fruit texture. Yeah. Well, definitely, we still get some health benefits, wasn't great. right? Yeah, but you know, off of a twenty foot or twenty inch uh, <laughs> cutting, you know, that's definitely that's quite a feat. Probably enough, not enough energy. So yes, definitely a little disappointment on the taste. Yeah, it but... still make a good smoothie. Oh, it would definitely. And you still get the health benefits of dragon fruit. That's true. All the antioxidants and but the fiber. I would give that a very low rating as far as taste. I'd give it like a five, man. What would you give it? I'd probably give it a two. Two? Two uh, out of 10. All right, let's say like a three. It was pretty bad. It was pretty bad. <laughs> I mean, it just tasted like, it just tasted healthy. Like Yeah, it, tastes like, like plant. Like all the, if you took all the, like the healthy part of the dragon fruit <laughs> and none of the good part, just kind of have that. Like it just tastes like, a, like a, almost like, being like a beet or something, you know? It's like just all, all that. <laughs> very, very but, flat. Whatever. If no it was sweetness. in something, if it was in something and the texture's still nice. But. Yeah. All right. Well, we'll keep them coming. Give us a like and a subscribe. Have a great day. Armando. Dude, it's creepy.